What's going on, guys? It's your boy Andy Matrix, and holy moly, holy freaking moly's, bro! I had no idea that this was going on. I had no idea that this was happening in Japan. <laughs> so apparently, by the way, but I want to make it very clear. I want to make it very clear. Um, I've never. I don't want to be a political channel. Like this is this. I don't like to bring in politics, but this this is what's happening in Japan. And because I talk about Japanese culture, I gotta talk about things that are happening. The reason why I decided to talk about this is because it involves artists. Yes, Japanese artists that were actually being censored in Japanese Twitter. You know, I got some stuff to say about them. Some some news that's been things have been happening. So yeah, I'm here bounding into comics. And looks like the Japanese are actually pretty happy that Elon Musk took over. Guys, but before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the notification bell for future notifications. I talk about anime, manga, video games, geek culture, and Japanese culture. If you're into any of that stuff, then make sure to subscribe. And guys, follow me on Twitter. The link is down below. Okay, now let's get to it. Let's get to it. All right, so it says Japanese Twitter users report political content no longer being pushed into their feeds following Elon Musk takeover. Um, okay, so what's happening in Japanese Twitter? Because apparently, apparently the same thing that was happening in Japan with Japanese Twitter, no, no, it's the same thing that was happening in America with Twitter is ha was happening in Japan, and it was kind of messed up because, you know what? Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Right. So first of all. It says, in what some are declaring a Twitter cultural revolution, Yahoo Japan, translated via D, uh, DeepL, has reported that the, that during during mass pass uh, mass purge of Twitter staff, a purge which included the Twitter Twitter Japan, yeah, the, the Twitter Japan curation team, <laughs> former ja former employees of Twitter Japan public relations department shut down Japanese Twitter's official news feed in moments. Wow. So nobody is safe. Nobody's safe. And honestly, honestly, because apparently these this curation team in Japan, they were doing similar t similar things that were that was happening in America. And look, I always say that, you know, things like things like ephemism, <coughs> ephemism, you guys know what I'm talking about. And things like the W.O.K.E. and the SJWs. Japan does have SJWs, but not like in America. OK, so, yeah, just keep that in mind. Um, it does have, they do have those things, but it's not as big as, as over here. It's very mild. And, but I'm surprised at some of the things that they actually did. So check this out. It says throughout this shutdown, as users trend newsfeed in, in moments started to be generated organically rather than by the algorithm, they began to notice that they were no longer seeing a disproportionate amount of left wing media sources, including Asahi Shimbu TV, Asahi, uh, BuzzFeed Japan. Huffington Post Japan forced into the exterior experience. Hmm. It says, as such, Japanese Twitter users began accusing the Twitter Twitter Japan curation team of not only giving preferential to said media outlets, but also manually implementing a specific t a specification to insert tweets containing these articles, topics, and words in users' timelines without permission. That's just wrong. Yeah. So basically, they were adding in things into the timeline to push to basically push like uh, a lot of the media websites a lot of the media website me like news websites it, it basically to push agendas anything that has to, to do with politics is they always put it in front of your face just because but hey whatever and this is this is japan this is not america so um and then and then and then and then this was really interesting this is really interesting because apparently where is it? Okay, so the concept artist, the concept artist for Pokemon and Final Fantasy VII Remake, it says Yo Shimizu, listed the new the new changes they have seen on Twitter after Elon Musk took this, the reins. Of Twitter says political tweets have stopped flowing, tr have stopped flowing. Trends have become convincing, such as anime commentary. Yeah, weird tags have disappeared from trends, and. People who who were in, invisible, even though they they were mutual in mutual in low visibility, new are only good ch changes so far, right? This is this guy, this guy right here. Holy crap! This guy right here, he was the concept artist of Pokemon in Final Fantasy VII. 
yeah this is why i wanted to make this video because if even artists are talking are talking about this stuff guys uh but anyways and then we have um uh, another one here so this is this was very interesting because this kind of reminds me th this really tells me that japan is kind of like buying into a lot of the things that america is doing so this one says one of the most notable allegations uh, leveled against twitter japan curation team was that they had been enforcing strict skin color regulations on artists choosing to promote artwork of dark skin characters over those of lighter skin ones you know a lot of people ask why why treat the customer this way why because fuck them that's why so yeah so basically they would promote artwork of anime characters that had a darker skin tone than light skin tones gee um i mean if that doesn't sound like racist racism to you then i don't know what is because why are you choosing one skin color over the other they should have like some equal you know finding in the twitter search engine of any kind of artwork but they decided specifically to promote the dark skin color ones and look i mean they got a picture of you know uh, my dress of Dali, Mark Itagawa, in her Gyaru style. And I like my I like brown chicks as much as I don't know any other dude. You know, I like I like you know Thai women, Filipinas. But I mean I don't think that they should be promoted over one over you know light skinned girls. You know, everybody they should all get the same type of promotion. Uh, on the algorithm, right? The certain search ability in the algorithm. So shame on you, Japanese Twitter. And then it says, it seems that the illustrator's shadow bands has been lifted one after the other. And I've been quite, uh, I've been quite in a few search results. Noted, uh, Hoshimi 12 skin color regulations were on, unusually strict only in the Japan region. And Twitter Japan people really control the media as they liked. Yeah. Yeah, they did. This is another artist. And here's another artist, right? Said additional, additionally, artists have been celebrating... Uh, the liberation from the shadow bands under the hashtag twitter easter tl using the hashtag artists are utilizing the social network tool by tweeting out their art to reconnect with with or gain new fans good good it says amongst the sea of artists ec ecstatic to hear the news were the creators of pretty cure manga so there's a manga called purity cure the series says uh kamikita twins who tweeted so i'm going to test are you seeing this on the tlc <laughs> wow man so yeah this so i guess this this manga artist or this artist you know they're kind of celebrating like wow oh well i guess the, the the algorithm's back to normal all thanks to our boy elon musk okay so elon so twitter it hasn't really changed that much the only thing that really has changed about twitter is that um it, they kind of they kind of release a lot of the like all bull bull crap a lot of the bs algorithms like the banning people a lot of the people that were banned are coming back you know things like things of that nature but twitter is pretty much still the same elon musk really has not added anything to twitter so yeah uh and that's pretty much it this is really interesting i mean i had absolutely no idea that you know you know japan had this kind of curation team in in you know in, on twitter over there but that that pretty much tells you the type of the type of people that they want to you know that they want to hire right whether if it's in japan america or the uk you know these companies especially the tech companies they want to hire a certain type of person and that certain type of person is basically what we've been talking about you know for years now on twitter you guys you guys know the type of person i'm talking about i'm gonna put a picture of them right here <laughs> you guys know exactly what we're talking about but man that was really interesting and again we didn't really get too political here but it is we know what type of political content um was being pushed on twitter and now i, I guess the japanese are kind of like you know celebrating the little freedom from that so whatever your thoughts are make sure to comment below make sure to like this video uh, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell for future notifications. Guys, this is your boy Andy Matrix. Thank you for watching and listening. Godspeed!